Puta, onde que tá agora, pô? Olha lá, olha lá. Véi do céu. Falei que eu tava vendo alguma coisa. Lá do teu lado, lá, pô. Nem, nem quatro horas ainda, velho. Dá tempo nem pra lençóis voltar pra Bauru ainda. Olha isso, velho. Olha isso. Ó, teu puta, você não tem que ver onde o Zul vai buscar isso aqui, velho. Você não tá vendo nada aí, filho. Você tem que ver aqui na, na máquina. Ô, Rafa, tá virando, velho. Puta que pariu, velho. Pera aí, para de ser medroso, caramba! Puta que pariu, bicho! Hey everybody, this is Miss American Bunker giving you my view of what's going on. And here we can see the cloud that the UFO seems to come out of and go back into. But if you look below it, there's a very interesting area there as well. When it drops, the brilliant areas drop out of the cloud, so to speak. They come down to this area. Okay, this is some type of a alien aspect to it. See, it's pearl gray, and it's head-shaped. This is dark green. Here's your blue sky. There's something here as well. I believe it to be animal shaped. Very small right here. Or multiple small areas. But definitely alien in nature activity there. Here without any adjustment. You can see this is darkish gray. Here's your white sky. Here's your green area. If you light it up just a little bit, it's a little bit easier to see. And that's with no adjustment. Okay. And you can see it from afar. And there are other very questionable areas on the ground, but This is the most important because this, again, is where the orbs fall into. Let's go ahead and look at this before it goes into the cloud. Okay, this is actually a ship. I mean, we have two of them, two craft. This is a larger one. And you really don't get a better view unless you use edge detection. And with that you can see there's something on top or coming out of it, at least at this moment. It's full screen. If I tune in this whole area, there are other alien craft here, but I'm going to tune in this area. You can see this is one as well. There's some type of a platform almost. It's just going to give us a generalized shape. But if you put on the edge, that's with no brightness. Add a little bit of brightness to it. Maybe a little focus. You get a better idea what might be there. 
or what is there, not what might be, because it can't outline anything that isn't there. So you're actually getting more information from this than you are a simple close-up. Simple close-up looks like this. Put the edge on and a little bit of light. You can see outlines and you can see movement. You can't see that without it. Sometimes that's what it requires. So we have our craft up here. It's a little object poking out of it. Let's pull that back. Here we are. Okay, I stopped it. And this cloud, or this craft, is starting to morph. Look at the elongation aspect to it, head shape. Can you see that? Okay, we're doing this for investigative purposes. It doesn't look as good, but it shows you how it changes and morphs. Here's our smaller UFO. It's right here. Here's our creatures, animals down here. In fact, let me show you. See the creature? Alien? This is the layout. Heads. Look at this head shape here. Craft is right above it. And let's watch that play. See our craft here morphing? animal shape over here and another ship. serpent-like. Here's our head shape. Without the edge, Without any adjustment, this is all you see. With the edge, you see this. So all I did was add a little bit of light. So we see that. figures up here. 
its elongated head now almost. Take it back and let it play at regular speed. Note, watch the pulsation and the flashing. Okay, right before it hits, let's look at it and see what it looks like. What came out? shapes here and here alien shapes. We see two areas here. It's hard to tell. They could be connected. I see a light, very light marks here without any brightness with just the edge. You see it like this. ET looking. All of it. Let's um, pull this up. Looks like entities. But they're attached almost like a slinky motion. coming down. Got, see your shapes here. See that slinky motion again. It's linked. There's a head shape here though. Add a little light. Doesn't help. That looks like two distinct areas. Look at it. Let's move in. Looks creature head shape. before it goes down and backing it up. Here it comes. There it is. There it goes. So, when you're driving along the road, you never know what might be going on, I guess, along the side of the road. I hope you saw something interesting. I thank you for watching. I invite you to come back.